Hi, this is Tony. I just wanted to do a quick video on my daughter. A lot of you might know she died. A uh, nine-year-old daughter died December 24th in a sudden car crash. But before she died, she must have... The only thing that makes sense, she must have got her uh, spiritual eyes. So this is a video case. You know, you never know. If something happens to me, I don't want this to be mentioned, but just to help other people that lost kids or anybody to give hope. What she told me was she must have got her spiritual eyes. That's the only thing that makes sense to me is that um, different occasions, different times in the year 2013 before she passed that she saw the feast table in 2012. At that time she told me she saw the feast table. She didn't give much details. and. And then another instant down the road. Didn't write it down, but it, made, it seemed like a couple months. She was inside the back seat of the car. We were loading the kids up for the car. I was in the back seat, making sure their seatbelts were good. And then she said, through the roof, she can see angels, like total transparent, like there's no roof. And, and she kept asking and asking if I saw the same thing she saw. I said, no, no, Mariah. She thought I was messing with her because she saw him and I couldn't so you know how you nothing that can make sense is uh sometimes you know before your time's up you can you see stuff you know spiritually you get your spiritual eyes into that world because you're about I don't know maybe because you're ready to do your transition and then when I was doing CNA before the job I'm doing now you know, in a nursing home, sometimes they would say they would see stuff, you know, you, know, you would hear stories. And so, I believe her. So. And then she saw other entities she told me about that weren't so nice, you know, a few occasions. Um, I told her, you know, tell me, you know. About the feast table, it was about a year she waited to tell me, so. Maybe she was worried about how how I would react and what I would think. So, you know, we we're just past the year mark where she died. So it's a new year. So I got through that tough time, you know. So today's a new day of the new year, and I want her story to be told. My daughter, Mariah. Um, yeah, they were at a stoplight in the country road. The light just turned green. They were just ready to start to proceed through the green light. And the car behind them didn't stop. And they were doing 55, whatever, plus, And rear-ended where my daughter was. Went through all the way through the glass into her back seat. And pushed her back seat all the way to the front seat. You know, got her head. So, so they were rear-ended in the, the car my daughter was in. And she got it. She got the blunt of it. So. And then the car flipped, turned sideways, and then flipped again back on its wheels. So. so it got hit, slammed hard. It was a Ford Expedition. They rear ended, and my daughter was in the RAV4. So the bumpers didn't match up. The bumper on the Expedition was real high and just went straight through the glass, straight to her head. So. so. She didn't have a chance. So, anyways, so hopefully this encourages you. I said, no matter what, I'll be strong for Jesus. I got on YouTube 2007. I ain't perfect. I have my struggles. But I'm trying to do better, you know. And I pray every day. So, just uh, come to Jesus just as you are. You don't need to go through a man, a priest. You can just come where you're at, just come to Jesus, accept him. We'll never be perfect until we're with Jesus. We're still in the unperfect world, unperfect body. So we're all going to struggle. We're all in the same game. The main thing is you accept Jesus or you don't. So that's what life's about. And you'll find out on the other side. Alright. I do this out of love, so... 
you take it as hate speech, we know you're not saved. So, yeah, I pray you are. I love. It's the only reason I go on the channel on Google Plus or YouTube. Out of love. Only. Alright. Love you guys. This video is about my daughter. Miss you. I love you. I know you're good and safe. And I'm so glad I said I love you all the time. And showed you love. So. If you haven't done that for your kids, do it tonight. Alright. You never know. Love you. Except Jesus. Bye.